everybody welcome back to our channel so um it's just gonna be me today because i'm gonna do a hair video my partner's not really into that stuff um so i'm gonna be comparing two blow dryers which are these two the turbo 1500 and the dyson um this is normally the type of blow dryer that you will see in a lot of hispanic salons um if there aren't other places i would know i wouldn't go to hispanic places um and then the dyson um, the weight difference is a lot. The size, you can see the comparison. Um, it's a lot. So, this is how the Turbo 1500 sounds. And that's, that's on all the way, all the power. And then this is how the Dyson sounds. With all the fans. Um, definitely two different vibes with both. So I'm on the growing out process because I did a big chop back in December. My hair used to be almost down to my butt. And um, so this is the product that I use. Um, they're like hair growth um, drops that you use. They come with a dropper like this. And then all you need is one long thing and then you drop it all over your hair. I also use the coconut. I love the Mark Anthony line. So this is a this is one of the products that I love because it is a dry oil, so it's not gonna leave it um, greasy the hair. And then my two favorite leave-in conditioners are it's a ten light because again my hair is really greasy, so it doesn't weigh down the hair. And then I love the Grow Long leave-in conditioner by the Mark Anthony brands as well. Um, when it comes to shampoo and conditioner. Um, right now, I don't have necessarily a favorite one, but right now I'm using this one from Elber Essences with the conditioner. And I'm also using, well, this is my favorite line, actually, the Grow Long from Mark Anthony. I used it even when my hair was very, very long. It smells very good. It has um, caffeine and ginseng in it, so it's very good for your hair. So... What we're gonna do is I already applied today. I used the grow long leave-in. It's already detangled. It already has everything it needs. Um, and then I'm gonna do four four little moños. <laughs> um, four little buns, I guess. So oh, I speak a lot of Spanish, so if you guys may hear the language changing my apologies it's like second nature one side is going to be the dyson and the other side is going to be my turbo power my turbo power dryer and then the brush i'm going to be using is the ion one i got this from sally's so let's get started i'm going to fast forward everything um so it's going to be like a time lapse i think or however you guys see it of one side of my hair and then the next so I, I, I see. Okay, so this is the final result with the turbo. I have a lot of experience with this blow dryer because um, my mother used to have it when I was younger and I learned to use it and everything. So I know how to grip it. The grip is actually very easy because um, it's more comfortable for me to use up here or to hold it like this sometimes. So it took me about 15 minutes to do half of my hair with the turbo completely dry. Disclaimer, I should have done this in the beginning. I'm not claiming to be a professional hairstylist. 
of that sort um this is what works for me this is what i've been doing for years um so yeah so let's go over and start this side so now we're gonna go over to this side and we're going to do the dice line so back this is the finished product this side was the red turbo and then this one was the dyson i'm gonna use my dry oil i love this it smells delicious so what i do i don't spray it on the hair i just do a few one two it's like a mist rub it in and only on the bottom of the hair um and then a little bit here and a little bit here and then that's it and then the rest and i could go through my whole hair um i will say they are pretty identical i wouldn't necessarily the only difference i would say between these two um dryers is obviously the price this goes for four hundred dollars and this goes for between 80 and 100 dollars um normally you can find these on beauty supplies usually any beauty supply will carry this different the different you will see different colors of these the different colors um signifying the different wattages this one on the other hand has different colors same wattages the only different ones are the professional ones which you can only get through the Dyson website or if you work in a legitimate hair styling place. Um, this one I got it in Sephora and I was able to use um, a few of my Sephora VIP boy, VIB um, points um, to get some money off for me to be able to purchase this. Do I regret my purchase? No, I've actually been thinking about it for a very long time about getting this because I do do a lot of my family members hair and a lot of my um, partner's family members hair even her hair so it's much easier for me to travel with this than with my big turbo but comparing the both blow dryers the shininess on both sides um i wouldn't choose one over the other if i do it will be weight wise and travel friendly wise um but that's about it especially if you have a good brush the iron brushes are amazing i didn't have to switch out brushes when it comes to my hair because this holds like this grips the hair very well for you to be able to use any type of blow dryer i do suggest if you are going to use a blow dryer invest in a good blow dryer you don't have to spend four hundred dollars on a blow dryer you don't have to spend a hundred dollars on a blow dryer like i said this is a very good blow dryer um and it cost me about $84 here in New Jersey. In New York, it'll be between $84.90 to $100, depending on the beauty supply that you go to and whatever taxes they apply to it. But again, this, um, the one I used to use before this one was exactly the same. Same brand and everything, but it was my mother's. And I'm 26 and she's had it for over 10 years. And it works like a charm and then this is fairly new because i got it um it's about to be a year old and it works like a charm as well because it's very new this blow dry doesn't i don't even have a month with it so um that's that it took me about 30 minutes to complete my whole head right now it's pretty straight so what i would normally do at night i will wrap it with um a revesilla one of these nets um, I would use that to go to sleep and that's about it and before I put my exit out there um, if you're gonna buy this from Sephora 
I will suggest you to use, if you have points, to use your points. And ask, call ahead of time before going, because sometimes Sephora will only display what they want to sell and won't display what they have in the back. Um, that's what happened when I first purchased this. I was looking for the black one, which I got, um, but I didn't look at the box. So when I purchased it and I brought it home, it was the silver and white one. The thing with that one, same dryer, perfectly fine. It didn't come with the bundle. If you get bundles, my bundle, it came with the Way um, hair products. For the same exact price, same discount and everything. So if you're going to spend the money, I will say spend the money, but get something out of it as well. So I got the Memory Mist Spray from Way. I got the texturizing hairspray. Um, I got the leave-in conditioner and I also got the body oil. So I got four products on top of the blow dryer, on top of the perks that the blow dryer brings, like the three nozzles, the mat, and everything else um, like that. There are some sets that bring the Way products in them and also carrying case. Because it wasn't the holidays, this set did not bring the carrying case, which sucks but um that's about it i hope you guys enjoyed like comment and subscribe see if you guys want to see anything else any questions any type of videos i'm gonna see if we go on a schedule to upload a, on specific days um but right now we're still up and coming so thanks for watching have a good one bye